designing three completely different packages. And to make it a challenge, I'm only going to give myself two minutes to design the first one, 20 minutes for the second, and then up to two hours for the third. All right, so let's get straight into it. I'm going to start with the first package design right here, which is the bag of chips. All right, we're just going to drop the logo in. That literally took longer than I thought it would somehow. Just try and place this real quick, and then I'll change the color of the bag too. Change it to that same yellow, basically. All right, now we just got to basically put some classic text. Basically, whatever I can fit in the amount of time. Try and put some effect to the text at least a little bit so it's not, like, boring. And then what I'm going to do... Only got 27 seconds. All right, now we just basically needed some chips to drag and drop in here real quick. I think this is probably the last thing I'm going to be able to do. I'm going to just try and clip and mask them too, so I don't really have to worry about it. Great clipping mask. All right, there we go. I think that's the best we could have done that quick. All right, now moving on to the next one. This is drink can right here, the soda can basically. And we only have 20 minutes, obviously. So we're going to set the timer right away and get started. And I'm not going to lie, this one, I'm not going to just go for the first logo right away. I actually have some time so I can kind of look through and see what's going to be the best. All right, now we got our start for sure right there. We got the little Coca-Cola thing right there. I think that's a good placement for it. I'm going to quickly do these texts right here at the bottom, the little ounces right there in the milliliters. All right, I made that text right there. I'm going to make the opacity a little bit lower so it kind of goes into the can. And I'm pretty sure this says 140 calories per can, so we'll just put that little thing right above that text right there too. All right, there we go. Now I'm gonna just combine all that text right there and just make it fit better. And now we still got 14 minutes left, so I think I'm just gonna kind of try some different designs and stuff like that on the background of it, since it still looks a little plain. Since it is a drink, I kind of want to try this first, this little water design right here for a background, and I'll probably just change the color to red. All right, there we go. And I'm gonna just change the saturation up. I'm gonna turn the opacity way down. See how that looks in the background at least. Right, I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like how it looks uh, throughout the whole one, throughout the whole can. So I think I'm gonna just put it at the top right here and then do something else towards this bottom middle and middle part. Since this is still hanging off a little bit, I'm gonna erase it and make it look all clean. All right, there we go, erase it all right there. We got that little part as the background. I can even turn it up too right there just so you can still see it a little bit but it's not popping out too much and i think i'm gonna take this same logo right here and i'm gonna just basically copy and paste it put it in the background of it and then just turn down the opacity a lot just kind of see how that blends in together like that i do kind of like how that looks but i think i'm just gonna mess with the eraser a little bit to make it look a little cleaner so it just gives it a little bit of detail just a barely anything basically but i think it's still good and now for the next thing, since we have only less than 10 minutes left still a good amount of time there's these little white lines going around right here I think we definitely need something else, so I'm gonna try something like that on this side of the can. All right, so if I basically search up these Coca-Cola lines right here on Google, as you guys can see, it does actually have the exact ones, I think, basically. But I feel like that's too simple, so I'm gonna try and look for maybe some different ones. We got this one right here where it's like two hands connecting, giving the bottle, as you guys can see. We got this one right here, which is a lot bigger. You maybe can use that on the can. I'm gonna cut out the background and actually try and use it just like this, since the red will still be filled in right here. I just gotta erase the sides right there so it look like it's kind of in the can. And I'm going to duplicate it and actually use it again over here. All right, so now that we put both of them in, I'm going to turn on the opacity, maybe just a little bit. Honestly, I think the one at the top kind of doesn't really sit in too well. Maybe if I put it down here. I'm going to drag this one under the text for like an underline kind of like effect right there. And I'm going to just let this one run the whole middle of the can basically since the other one, you know, the original, it basically doesn't have too much going on anyway. We only got four minutes left, so I'm going to just mess with some extra touch-ups and stuff like that. See if there's anything else I can make it look more smooth since we still have time. All right, so we got like about a minute left. I think we're done right here. We just added like a, basically a little bit of extra water effect under it right there at the bottom. Didn't really know what else to add while still keeping it, you know, simple and stuff like that. But I think that's it for the second package right there for the 20 minutes one. Now let's move on to the final one. We got two hours maximum to complete that one. All right, so now for the third and final design, obviously we got this milk packaging right here. I wasn't going to do this one at first, but I haven't seen anybody basically design with this, I think. So I decided to just give it a try. So to start the timer, we got two hours, like I said. Let's see what we can turn this into. I'm basically going to go for this right here obviously but i'm actually gonna try and make sure you know it's not got like too much text on it everywhere i feel like it's just too much so the first thing i'm gonna do is i'm actually just gonna basically erase the top part of it and the bottom part just so i can get that blue by itself we inverse it so it deletes everything but the blue and i'm gonna turn up the saturation and i'm gonna bring back the back of it right there with the other one i'm gonna make sure the drop shadow so we can actually make sure we see what's going on let me take out the glow there we go, and I'm actually make this one a little bit bigger too, so I can just kind of see it exactly the same. All right, and just to keep the same, you know, coloring scheme and everything like that, they do kind of basically got, you know, the white, the orange, or the yellow, I guess, and the red, obviously. So I'm gonna change the even the tab right here to yellow too. 
now we just gotta find the font for the main text the horizon right there too. All right, i think this one looks similar enough i'm gonna just make the h a little bit bigger in the n2 as well so it kind of matches that same style all right there we go now we got this main text right there to start from all right and then next after the text for this design right here with the little cow right there and then obviously the world behind it and everything i found this right here on google but i want to make it a little bit different i want to make the world like in a little bit of a different place so it's going to take some time to cut that out and right, now that i've been cutting this out right here like i said i'm just taking the world out of it right there and it is working but there's definitely a problem with it it's definitely a lot messier and stuff like that i'm gonna try and fix it up and see what i can do but might not be able to use it all right i think we did it as best as we could get it uh, there's still a little bit part to cut out right here at the top but yeah now i can basically just use this and i can put the world in a different spot make it look a little bit different i will actually put it behind the text a little bit too and then i put a clipping mask so it kind of stays inside of the design right there too and if i just release the clipping mask it's going to hang out off the side like that so i don't want that and i'll put a little bit of shadow on it too just so it kind of matches with the text more right now they basically just have like a you know cartoon style same as that right there but it's a world so i'm gonna just get one of those right here now we got this world right here i think i'm gonna actually put a clipping mask on it and then just put it kind of like that right there inside of it then i might put it kind of like this and then just put the opacity way lower kind of looks weird on the color but just desaturate it make it gray basically and then put the opacity down then we kind of just get the outline of it then i'm gonna take the smaller version of it too still keep this one but put it way smaller I actually put it off to the side right there because I kind of think it's a little bit boring putting everything just dead center in the middle. And I will start on some moving on some of the text right here. All right now I'll just put basically this little yellow box right here to add some text inside of it. I'll make it actually a little bit thinner too so it doesn't get in the way of the other design on the side. All right, and then I just basically put the same text right here, the DHA Omega 3 right there. Now we got that right there. I put it a little bit bigger too so it fills up a good amount of space now we got some more text added onto here right there i'm actually make this one a little bit smaller so it doesn't pop out as much it's not really the main text all right now i think that's basically done like i said i didn't want to add too much text definitely added a lot like all the world stuff in the background and all these little things right there and i definitely think it comes together to not be too much but also definitely enough at the same time to match up with this since there's so much on here